Hey there friends, welcome back to Low Effort Gardening. Today I did a simple experiment that had some surprising results. I poured water on plain soil and watched it run off. Then I poured water onto compost and watched it soak right in. Curious about why this happens? I am. So let's find out together. First, I took a patch of dry soil. When I poured the water on it, it barely soaked in and mostly ran off the surface. Then I poured water on a bed of compost. This time, the water absorbed almost immediately. It's actually satisfying to watch. So why did the water run off the soil? Well, dry and compacted soil has particles that are really tightly packed together. There aren't many spaces for the water to enter. In fact, dry soil can become hydrophobic, which means it repels water. Compost mulch is different. It's made of organic matter that's loose and full of tiny air pockets. These spaces allow water to flow in easily. Plus, the organic matter in the compost attracts water, helping it soak in rather than run off. If you're enjoying this video and the content that I create here on YouTube, please take a moment to like and subscribe. It's free and in helps support the channel so that I can continue bringing valuable gardening tips and insights. Using compost mulch doesn't just help with absorption. It keeps the soil moist longer, provides nutrients as it breaks down, and improves soil structure over time. Adding compost mulch to your garden is easy. Spread a layer about two to four inches thick, either around your plant or in the bed. Just be sure not to pile it too close to the stems to avoid rot. So there you have it. Water runs off dry compacted soil, but soaks into compost mulch because of mulch's structure and composition. By using compost mulch, you can help your garden retain water and stay healthy with less effort. Thanks for joining me in this video, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Happy gardening.